I, I really am just uh, blown away by this conference. I've learned so much in the first uh, three lectures already, and I wanted to thank, uh, thank Sang and Kyle uh, and all of you for being here today and sharing this whole day with, with us and uh, me with you, because uh, I think it's just, just wonderful. Um, I did, would like to start, I have some disclosures. I'm in California now, I'm not on the East Coast. We all know that Tom Brady cheated. Uh, and I used 12, uh, 12 PSI in the belly. It's a little softer, and when it gets cold, I can just throw it a little bit better. It's a little easier to catch. And I have been a consultant for Intuitive. So it's interesting that the topic was, what are managing indications for cost? So I thought we'd just start by defining what an indication is. In medicine, it's a valid reason to use a certain test, medication, procedure, or surgery. So first, I guess we have to determine if there are any indications for robotics, because perhaps by this definition, there, there might not be anybody. Um, I guess this goes to um, disclosures. I have not always been a fan, and to me, it seemed like the emperor's new clothes where uh, everyone was afraid to say that the emperor was naked um, because they didn't want to appear stupid and in this case, you know, not modern and not cutting edge and not as good as your peers. Um, and it seemed, especially at first and maybe after this talk, it may still seem, that we're forcing technology to do what we could already do more inexpensively. Uh, as Kyle's, Kyle's talk was just great. A port placement with the robot can be difficult. With the more modern robots, with the XI, it's a little bit easier, but with the SI, uh, it was, it was uh, challenging. It was hard or frustrating to operate in multiple quadrants with the robot. I didn't understand what a robotic uh, col colon or rectal resection was if you're also using laparoscopic instruments, because I might as well just keep using the laparoscopic instruments. And again, I was comfortable uh, with laparoscopy. Now, because we're a small group, we can all be honest with each other. I was a little bit scared also. It is scary to go from something that you do well, whether laparoscopic surgery or open surgery, and go into an arena where you're not exactly sure where you are. And, and robotics does separate you from the patient with a physical distance, and that is intimidating. Uh, and I have to also admit that if I got the ports in, I was just basically done. I mean, because I knew how to do the operation from there. It was just basically laparoscopy. Uh, I just had to get the ports in in the right spot. And once I was sitting at the console, I was okay. Um, I would also say about robotics, uh, does anyone know what this is? This group of hag hash hashtag rough kind of nerdy people is? Well, they're all about the world's richest people. That's Microsoft in their first 